I've been lucky enough to come and see them in China. I've seen them in Russia and it's been freezing cold, unbelievably cold there. I've seen them in Spain in the summer and it's unbelievably hot. The aim of the Great Bustard Group, number one was to restore the old Great Bustard population here in Wiltshire. They used to be Great Bustards, they were all killed, bring them back here. Whereas to me, a conservation activist is someone who does something. But it's, it's not something you would do to get rich. Um, but look at this, I mean, this is, this is my office. It's pretty good. Feeding the Great Bustards is, is something we've spent a lot of time working on and developing the right diet. Yeah, when we, when we rear the chicks, we wear these very funny, funny costumes. For the first week, um, the chicks can't feed themselves. They need that puppet to, to bill feed them. Um, when they're small, they need to be fed every hour. If you've got a lot of chicks, it takes about an hour to do. So you just end up as a complete cycle. After about a week, they start to peck themselves. So the great bustards don't need massive reserves. As long as there's a good landscape generally, you just need little small areas that are managed for them. The, the areas we manage for great bustards also provides wonderful habitat for many other birds. You can see that through the history of the project. We have got better and better and better. The last three years, the population has been self-sustaining. And this year, 2019, will be our last trip to, to collect eggs and bring them back. At the end of this summer, we should have, here in Wiltshire, over 100 birds. Um, so we reasonably predict that in the next 10 to 15 years, our population will just grow on its own. If I'm the person at the front normally doing the talking, it's only because I've got this fantastic team of people um, all around me making it happen. I don't have children. For me, it, it's much more important to leave Great Bustards. Great Bustards are a better legacy than yet more people.